Wynwood Island is a railway island, where the history expands from the past and into the present day, with many stories to tell. These are the stories of animals, friends, and families, and steam diesel and electric locomotives who were conserved under the almighty which was Sea Lightning Railway. A time of innovation, motivation, and change. For friends, family, animals, and their adventures, and steam diesel electrics and their services. These are the stories of locomotives and their crews who work hard to bring friendships by helping lending a hand and simply cheering them up while keeping their spirits high from their adventures. These are the adventures of the Sea Lightning Railway. Episode 14 Night of the Wolf Engine On the Sea Lightning Railway, engines are the best. They have their ordinary faces, but others have their different faces, like the cat engines, for instance. But one of those particular faces are the wolf engines. The engines are Sabretooth and Wolf. These two great western engines are mixed traffic. They can pull coaches and even trucks as well. But still, they are very useful and responsible engines. One glorious afternoon, Sabretooth and Wolf had arrived in SeaWorld. When they arrived, they met Rope on the siding with Eric. Hello there you two. How's it going? All very fine. We had no complaints. I'm glad to hear that, that you're having a good time. Yeah, that's what we are. Yeah, but we're just having a good time for ourselves. Yeah, but have you ever heard that the spooky hero team's called Super Monsters? Never heard of it. Well, there are the younger kids who turn themselves into Super Monsters when it comes out at night. And it got some awesome powers. Do you know about these words? You mean like... Expecto Humushi? No, Rope. The words are... Sundown, Monsters, Up. That way you'll be transformed like a super monster. Hmm, that's interesting. But then, out of nowhere, a wolf has been breakthrough to SeaWorld. Unbeknownst the rope, the wolf was wandering around and he sniffed some of these engines, including rope himself. Uh, guys, what is that wolf doing here? Hmm, maybe he was curious about something. Oh, so that wolf was. It took a shock and horror, the wolf was scratching to his smoke deflectors! Ah! Uh, my smoke deflectors are ruined! The wolf walks away and jumps into a fence, into its out of sight, leaving rope with a scratched smoke deflectors. Oh no, the smoke deflectors have been scratched! And now what am I gonna do now? Oh, don't worry, Rope. It will be repaired in no time. Yes, but you know what happens next? I was being myself cursed and saying that uh, in the moonlight, I was gonna be self transformed into a werewolf engine. And I have a red headlight 
and I'm just a terrifying werewolf engine. Rope, this one does not happen. Werewolf engines do not exist at all. Plus, you're thinking of something. <sighs> Thank goodness for that. Yeah, but what if, if you turn yourself into a wolf engine? Wait, you're saying that I'm gonna be myself into a wolf engine? Exactly. We're gonna use a magical powers that they did from the super monsters. Yeah, we're going to do ourselves tonight. Yeah, let's do it tonight! Rope was a little bit nervous. He had never been as a wolf engine before. It is almost sundown, and everything was set. And this is the moment what Rope was being transformed. Are you sure about this, Sabretooth? Yes, I'm really sure about this. When the sun is gone, and when the full moon comes out, you'll be transformed into a wolf engine. Yeah, you're gonna be served as a wolf engine yourself. Hmm, I'm not sure about this, but let's see what happens right now. Minutes have passed, the night covers all around it. The moon is full and shines brightly at night in the sky. Everybody knows the moon is made of cheese. <laughs> Alright, Eric, you're still thinking about Wallace and Gromit, right? Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. I was still thinking about it, sorry. I just thinking. So, do you think this will work, Sabretooth? Because the moon is now full and the stars are now starry. Oh yes, it will work, Rope. To make you transform into a wolf engine, you need to say, Sun down, monsters up. Is that all? Yes, it is. Say it with me. Sun down, monsters up. Okay. Sun down, monsters up. Alright. Sun down. Monsters up! Excellent! Now it's your turn! Okay, here I go. Right. Sun down! Monsters up! Hey, nothing happened! Wait for it! Yeah, it takes a little while. Oh. I think that. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait! What's happening? Whoa! Whoa! Oh, ah. Oh. It worked! Well, do you like it? I don't know about this, but I love it! How did it do that? Simple. It's a transformation, and it's magic. Wow! I didn't know it was so magic. Yes it is. And it looks awesome. Wow, I had never been as a wolf engine before. Later that night, Rope and Eric go out to sheds. Rope knew it has become a wolf engine like this. But his driver and his fireman had arrived. Come on you two, we have to go to the docks because there's a special shipment that we need to take. Me? Going myself as a wolf engine? I cannot go with this. No choice. We need to do this right now. I think I'll go as a back engine for instance. Yep. Now come on you two, we have to work to do. As you wish, drivers. When they arrived at the docks, they saw this very special cargo had arrived. <gasps> it's the sea monsters! Wow, they're creepy looking. 
but when they are going to take them? <laughs> Don't worry, you two. These sea monsters is going to take to the aquarium all the way to Transylvania. Because they're going to build a new aquarium right there. So, the aquarium sea monsters train was ready to go. Rope was so worried. Are you sure about this, driver? Yes, I'm sure. We're gonna make a good time in ourselves. Come on, let's go. Soon the two engines arrived at Cat City waiting at the signal. Danielle was there picking up the passengers. Hi Rope, you are a very looking wolf engine. Oh, 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 oh. Thanks. Uh, uh. uh Rope, are you okay? Uh, uh, no I'm not. I was being assigned to take the sea monsters to Transylvania because they have an aquarium right there. But when I arrived, people could see me laughing I was a good wolf engine. Haven't I, couldn't it? <laughs> oh Rob, you're a fine engine. We are look different. Really? Yeah, because we are so special ourselves. Oh, I think I understand now. Ah, oh, I see. Well, we must be up. See you, Danielle. As they are travel on the main line. Rope noticed something up ahead. It's the hill. I'll never make a time up. Yes, you can, Rope. You won't give up. But no, it was mercy like this. Don't think about that because you had to did the last time. No, it was only I did. And what if that you were late? You didn't stop, you did not. Remember that Lusitania helped you? Yes, I did. I don't care about being a good wolf engine. I don't want to have to do this, but I have to charge up this hill. Rob charges up the hill. And with all his might, he managed to do on time. Must not give up. Must not give up. We're almost there. We made it. We made it. We made it. Let's go. Look out, Transylvania. Here we come. Arrive at Transylvania Station triumphant but on time. Phew! 
We made it. Yeah, in the nick of time too. On the other platform, Sal was there with V. Hey there you two, you made it. You did it on time. Yeah, you made it safely. Really? We did? Yeah, instead you have come for one hour and ten minutes. You have come very fast in 50 minutes. Really? Wow, I never knew that. Yes, since you have been transformed into a wolf engine and with the long ears on the sides on the headlight, then we could call you Rope the Werewolf Engine. Yes, in Transylvania, we always have werewolf friends. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think, I think. Just then, Daniel came here. Well done, Rope. You have bring the Aquarium Monster Train all the way to Transylvania on time. You made a great achieve on a 52 minute run in less than 1 hour and 10 minutes. Which means you have covered a perfect run yourself. That must have been a 5 minute quicker than Benny the Golden Black 5. Oh, thank you, sir. Not with the help with my running mate, Eric. Yeah, it was our big effort to make it on time, sir. And Rope? I know that the curious Rope had been scratched one of your smoke deflectors. When you be back to normal in Twin Engine, you're gonna have a brand new smoke deflectors. Oh, thank you, sir. I couldn't wait for my new ones. Wasn't afterwards when Rope and Eric has to go back to SeaWorld as the light engines. But when Rope saw the sun rise over the sea, he could hardly hold on to his sleep. Good morning, Windward! As the sky is turning blue, Rope and Eric had arrived at SeaWorld. Sabretooth and Wolf were there. So, Rope, how are you feeling being as a wolf engine? That was awesome, Sabretooth! Yeah, you have a longest run night, and you have a great adventure being as a wolf engine. Yeah, but how am I gonna get transformed back to normal myself? Easy. Before you change into your form, you must say, Sun up, monsters down. Okay, I got it. Sun up, monsters down. <laughs> well, it looks like you're only just rope. Yes. It's good to be back to my form. Yeah, you have a lot of experiences yourself, right? Yep, I sure did. Yeah, it's a good thing that you're being back to normal yourself. Yes, I have been myself at night as a wolf engine. Would you try that new monster up?